Hey, welcome back to the channel, getting it done fishing. We're gonna get it done today in this video. You know, if you ever want catfishing or bluegill fishing or bass fishing, or you take your grandkids, your son, or even yourself, go trout fishing, and you know, and you go out there and you're casting it out there, and you're sitting there, you gotta hold the rod and you get some slack in the line. Boom, you get a hit and nothing. You got, oh, you gotta reel in the line, try to set the hook, and, and you miss it, right? So today, I'm gonna to go through what I think, I, I, I found the answer to it. You know, I take my kids catfish, my kids love to catfish. Uh, you know, we fish with Bob, or sometimes I, you know, I'll put weights on it, drop it down at the bottom, and I tell them, hey, hold the line. But, you know, the kids are kids, and sometimes they get boring, we all get bored, right? And you're messing around, and next thing you know, it hits it, and it just, it's just you know, you, you're literally quick, boom, right? And it spits it out. Well, you know what? I found a solution. I found a pretty cool product I wanna share with you. It's an automatic fish holder, but this one is actually even better than an automatic fish holder. You see them all the time. You get them at Walmart, Target. You can get them anywhere. You put your rod in, you hammer it down, you put your rod in, and you cast out. That's cool, right? That works. But this thing is, I found, is actually better. It actually automatically will trigger, and it'll set the hook for you, which is actually pretty cool. So, I actually found it on, I found it on on Amazon. I bought it on Amazon. I found these on, actually, I found them on, originally I went on a Timu. Searched on the Timu. They have a bunch of them on Timu, pretty cheap. And I found this one on Timu. It says, oh, it automatically sets a, you know, will set the hook for you. It's a, it's a spring to it. I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. I gotta check this out. So I took a look. I read some reviews. And I went on Amazon. I found one on Amazon. And I bought it on Amazon because I was like, if it doesn't work, I can send it back, which is a great thing about Amazon. So here it is. I actually bought two. I think it was two for uh, $14 or something like that, $7 a piece. It was actually pretty cool. So it comes out, goes in, and we're gonna set this thing up. It has a spring to it. You're gonna spring load that thing. And when you spring load that thing, you, you have your the little trigger mechanism, and that's gonna set in there. And you put your line through it, and when that tugs, that thing will snap. Now be very, very, very careful, especially if you have grandkids or younger kids or, or even yourself. Yeah, that thing thing does have some force to it. I mean, it's it's going to rip it up, and we're going to go through it. It's going to go So, and again, then it holds the rod. So we're going to set this thing up. So, again, the rod holder. Let's just get this thing out really quick. Okay, we're going to, you know, I just grabbed this. I just wanted something to sink. It's my fish, but I just grabbed a buzz bait. I know it sinks. We're just going to cast it out there. We're going to pound this into the ground. We're going to set it up. And we'll set the trigger a couple times just so you, you can see it. But like I said, you just bend. You can see it bends. And once it sets in place, that that's your trigger mechanism. So let's get it done. Get it done, son. Yes, sir. So it's actually pretty cool. And again, I brought uh, reviews on this, and there was a uh, review that somebody said they caught like over 300 or 400 trout fish with this thing. Uh, you know, this let, automatically sets the hook. So a lot of positive reviews on it. Uh, you know, again, as long as the line's tight, uh, you know, again, it it does kick. So again, make sure the kids aren't around. You know, safety, 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 or make sure that you set it up. And, and you don't mess around with it because once that thing triggers, we'll show you that that thing has a pretty hefty spring on that thing, and that thing's gonna go boosh. Yeah, you don't want to hit your finger and, and or anything like that. So let's set it up and let's go from there. All right, so I'm just gonna set it up here. All right, so first thing you do, don't even put the rod in, right? All right, so you got it. You put it here. You got it. Now you got. It. You put it in this way. Just drag it in there, make sure it's sturdy. It's pretty sturdy. All right, now I'm just gonna set that back and push that thing back. Now, I don't know if you can see, but now that that mechanism is in, the mechanism is in play. Okay, ready? So let me grab a, let's put it off this. So I'm gonna grab a stick. I'll show you, I'll show you the impact of this thing. You ready? So. See that? We'll get another angle on that. We'll set that back up. You ready? This is, you can see how hard it flips it, right? That's gonna set the hook pretty good. All right, so make sure that's in there. I'm gonna cast out. We're gonna set this bad boy up, all right? Let's go. Let's get it done, son. Yes, sir. Let's get it done. I just cast it out there, you ready? Got that in there. And I put my rod in there. All right, so I'm gonna adjust it. I'm gonna adjust it pretty, pretty tight if I can. It's kind of where I want it. 
All right? So pretty much where I want it. Now I'm gonna take my string, I'm gonna come down, and now my string is right there. You see how I do that? All right? Now I'm gonna go trigger that. Now it's pretty tight. Everything's pretty tight, and we're gonna trigger it. We're gonna see how that thing goes. You ready? All right, that's how it works. Let's trigger it again. So the thing is, let's get this. Let's get this thing. Let's get this thing readjusted. Let's get this thing readjusted. I like to go on a little angle. Push that back. It's locked in. Yeah, get my rod in there. You know what? I'm gonna do this. Let me do this. I'm gonna, actually I'm gonna put it a little bit on it. All right, you ready? Did that a little bit. I got that. Get some slack in there. Yeah, and you could do it any way you want it. So this is a little bit of an interesting because, all right, we'll do it one more time. Let's try it. I need to get it, I need to get it deeper in. All right, let me try one last time. All right, I got it in. Take this off, safety is our friend. Put that back. We're gonna go like here. I'm gonna go into a little bit different. Get that where that line is. It's pretty tight. Grab that line out here. Hold that. And that kind of switches in there. You see how that works? Line's in there. Let's run the red. All right, we'll trigger it up. You ready? One, two, three. Setting some hooks, son. That is it. All right, so that was pretty, uh, pretty cool, right? It seemed to work. You know, again, you know, I, I use bait cast uh, rods, but not spinning reels. You know, spinning rods, you could just pop that thing right down and slide right in. Again, you have your mechanism to lock it in. And as long as that line's tight, when you're when you cast it out and you put that line through, and you know, once you catch, or once that once a fish bites it, it's gonna set that hook. So pretty cool thing. Um, you know, again, you know, again, if you go cat fishing, trout fishing, even bluegill fishing, you take your grandkids, or you got just want to catch some fish, and you know, you set it out there. But, you know, once you set that hook, I mean, that rod's not going anywhere. Once that's up in the air like that. You know, once that's up in the air, that rod's not not going to go anywhere, and you, you hooked into the fish. If you have to go to the bathroom, hey, if you have to go to the bathroom, you're like, man, I'm doing some catfish, I gotta go to the bathroom. You know, pop this thing into the ground, pop your rod in there, put it in there, boom, go to the bathroom. If you catch one, you'll see it, it popped it up. Just be careful again, safety, safety, safety. It does have some pretty good, it does have some pretty good, uh, some to it to set that hook. All right, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Greatly appreciate it. And I'll check you next time. Getting it done fishing, out.